What you guys got another video here for you on how to upgrade to Windows 11 Pro from Windows 11 Home without reinstalling Windows. Now, quite a few people have uh, bought product keys before and uh, they can't seem to upgrade from Windows 11 Home to Windows 11 Pro without reinstalling Windows. But I'm going to show you a way how you can get around this and do it. It's pretty straightforward. But I've got a system here, as you can see. I'm going to come down to the activation here you can see it's not activated yet and i'll show you the full process here on how to activate it and how to do it legit and get a proper key here so you can see we are running a system with windows 11 home on it and it's the version 21 h2 which is the latest version now don't worry if you're running windows 10 home and you want to upgrade to windows 10 pro you can do the same thing and the same method will work for windows 10 as well as windows 11 so either way whether you're running Windows 10 or Windows 11, this method does work. So let me just show you here. So first off, this video has been sponsored by CD Key Sales. You'll need to head over to CD Key Sales and basically create an account. Then you need to log into that account and do a search for Windows uh, 10 Pro Keys or Windows 11 Pro Keys. You're looking for the OEM versions here and they need to be global and they're the ones that you want to look for. I will leave the links in the video description. Once you click on your option, you'll be able to see something looking like this, which is Windows 11 Pro OEM key. This is a global key. It's a Black Friday deal here. You just need to check. So check the region to make sure it's acceptable in your country to be able to activate. If you're not sure, then you can always contact them and ask them before you purchase. Once you're happy with your purchase, you can click on buy now. And this will take you to the uh, next screen where you can add in my promo code. Com promo code for this one is capital B capital R zero nine. Just add that in and apply this and this will give you a 35% discount. As you can see here, it's took it down to $17.67 and that is for a Windows 11 Pro key. And uh, that's it. Once you've got that, you can submit your order and uh, go to the next screen, which will be choosing whether you want to pay by card or PayPal. I generally choose PayPal here. So choose PayPal, select pay now, and you can put in your PayPal details and basically have that key. Once you get that, you go back to this window here, which is your account saying my purchased orders. You'll be able to see your purchased orders here and you'll be able to use that key to activate uh, your Windows 11 Pro once we've upgraded to it. So normally they ask you to do a fresh install and then use the key. And that's generally the way this site works. Well, I'll show you a way where you can just basically upgrade to Windows 11 Pro or Windows 10 Pro and then use your key to activate without having to reinstall Windows and lose all your data. Because let's face it, reinstalling Windows is a bit of a nightmare. You have to back up all your data and that can take some time. So first off, go to the settings pane here inside Windows and you'll see that this system isn't activated here. OK, so click on the activate now and this will take us to the activation center and you can see we're running Windows 11 home. And what we need to do here is click on change product key. The product key we need to use is a Windows 11 uh, Pro key or Windows 10 Pro key, but it has to be the generic key off of Microsoft so we can upgrade. We're not going to be using our Windows 11 Pro OEM key that we just purchased because this method does not work for those keys. First, you have to upgrade to Windows 11 Pro or Windows 10 Pro. Once you put in your generic key, it will ask you that we're going to upgrade your edition. Click Start, and it will then go and prepare the upgrade. This will go along and upgrade Windows. This is not going to activate Windows because it can't because it's a generic key. It's just going to basically allow you to upgrade. So let the upgrade process go through. And once it gets to the end here, I'll show you exactly what to do. It will say it will fail, but don't worry, it hasn't failed. You can see unable to upgrade your edition. This is what it says here. But it has actually upgraded to Windows 11 Pro, and it's also upgraded to Windows 10 Pro if you've used in Windows 10. So either one of those, it would work. So what we need to do is close this all off now. You'll get an error code. That's pretty normal. You just need to restart your PC. You can see updates are happening and this will go ahead and start to update your version of Windows from Windows 10 or Windows 11 Home to 
Windows 11 or Windows 10 Pro. So it will upgrade it from this stage. Now, we're still not activated yet, but that's OK. Uh, we're just getting the features added so we can then use that legitimate key that we just purchased to activate. So we'll let this go through here and finish off. And then we'll go ahead and I'll show you how to use your key that you just purchased to register your product. So let's go ahead and let this finish off. Now, I don't want to skip any steps because I really want you to see the full process so you can get an understanding of how this works. So what we've done here is we've tried to upgrade. It says it failed. We're going to reboot and it will go through the upgrade process. And now we're going to log back onto the system. So once we get to the desktop, we'll see what it looks like. There we go. We're at the desktop now. It looks exactly the same, and that's because it's the same OS apart from just upgrading to the Pro version from home. If we go to our About page here, you can see we are now running Windows 11 Pro. If you did Windows 10, you'd be seeing Windows 10 Pro in that location as well. So now what we need to do is activate our version and basically use our key that we've just purchased from CD Key Sales. So here we have our version here so now we're going to use our official key what we're going to do is go to change product key again because remember the key that we used is the generic key which will not be able to activate so we'll click on change product key here and now we can just put in our product key that we purchased uh, from cd key sales here so we just need to put this in here i'll blur this part out so you can't see it click next and basically once we click next it will go through and ask us to activate you will need to have an internet connection at this stage. So click activate. And uh, once this is done, it should activate our version. And there we go. It's Windows is activated. And we've just activated our version of Windows without reinstalling Windows. So I hope this video has been some use to you because I know a lot of people have a lot of stuff on their computers and they don't really want to uh, go through the installation process and reinstall Windows just to get uh, Windows 11 Pro or Windows 10 Pro. But this way you can use this little uh, workaround to get that upgraded and get either Windows 10 Pro or Windows 11 Pro. Anyway, I think that's going to be about it for this video. I'll leave all the links in the video description for you if you're interested. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. I just want to say a big special thanks to all the people that have joined my YouTube members group. Your names are rolling up on the screen right now. I really do appreciate the support. Have a lovely day and I shall see you again for another video real soon. Thanks again for watching. Bye for now.